Good day folks and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm in here in Kochi. I'm possibly going to be trying one of the best shawarmas in Kochi guys. If you're new here, I am George. I make new YouTube videos every week. So if you're not subscribed, consider subscribing for some exciting content. Anyways, let's head into this shop called Haji Ibrahim in Kochi guys. This is a shop. It's called Haji Ibrahim. They are founded in 1969. They told me they're the first people to bring shawarma to Cochin, so let's head in guys as usual the rest and location will be in my description box so this is the scene inside guys you see two huge shawarma skewers on the left is beef and on the right is chicken and a small joint here on the inside so let's try the shawarmas out guys uh, this is the chicken shawarma i already tried the beef shawarma and i loved it i didn't plan on getting another shawarma from here but i really wanted to try the chicken variant which is the reason why i thought you know might as well get it so even this is a very simple shawarma they've got some uh, chicken this is mayo instead of tahini i uh, told them to put tahini because they didn't have thum but they said you know go for the mayo one and there's some french fries some chicken and some mayo and again like i said they grill their romali roti guys and look at the size of the skewer guys this is humongous that's the chicken and this is their beef guys so i'm going to go for a bite of this now let's go cheers this mayo is not like a very classic mayo guys a little bit on the sour side a little bit more lemon i think a lot of chicken chicken is juicy a lot of french fries the grilling of the romali roti is just perfection guys Confidently, I can say that this is the first shawarma I'm having in India that is somewhat like something you would get in the Middle East, guys. I tried Al Taza. It's very average to my feeling. A lot in Mysore, a lot in Bangalore, but finally I have something that resembles very closely to what you would get in the Middle East. Amazing stuff, guys. Like I said, the romari is crisp, the chicken is juicy, the beef is also juicy. You have a lot of French fries. Only difference between the chicken and the uh, beef sharma is that the sauce they put on a beef sharma is tahini which is what is used in the Middle East on mutton and beef sharma in the Middle East they use the tahini sauce and on chicken you use thum but here instead of thum they use mayonnaise but um, mayo is not all that bad on the sharma guys it was a little bit on the tangier side it's not the classic mayo you'd find with normal Arabic food here in India it's a little bit on the tangier side great stuff though I'm, I'm just loving it guys the, both of the whole meat variants wow Loving it guys. They have also served me something. They told me they should try this out of all. It's called Karkede. I'll show you what that is. It's right there. So what they told me is an African hibiscus guys. So let's just try it out and give it a shot guys. It's definitely fizzy and we'll try it out now. There we go. Cheers. It's definitely slightly on the sweeter side. You get some kind of tang to it and moreover, I don't know how to explain this flavor guys. It's got some kind of earthiness to it. It's really refreshing. Spoon, other than spoon, it's like, oh, it's not a Wait, let me show you all, guys. There's some kind of flower inside it that you can eat. This is African hibiscus, that's what he said. It's got a very uh, firm texture to it, guys. It's like biting onto, you know, these orange uh, peels. That's the kind of texture you get, but not the same flavor. That's the kind of texture you get. A very strong, earthy flavor, too. Mm. Very refreshing to have with this, definitely because it's fizzy. Anyways, great stuff here guys. I'm so happy that I'm signing off my Kochi food ventures with Haji Ali here because such a great experience guys. Uh, I'll see you all again next week. Until then, love and peace.